Wait, did he just give me Corona? Hey, quick question. Do you want to be an Animal Crossing god? Well, I can't predict your answer, but I'd hope it would be yes, because you're viewing this strategy. Now, this strategy is actually a two-parter. One, for people who don't want to time skip, and two, for people that do and want to beat the game quickly. For all of you pure souls out there who don't want to time skip, basically all you gotta do is wait until Flick spawns on your island. This particular NPC buys bugs for higher than normal prices, allowing you to make a bunch of money and also improve your island quite a bit in a short amount of time. Flick won't always be on your island, but when they are, you definitely want to be able to take advantage of it. The best way to do this is by creating a flower bed, or just an area with a bunch of flowers, basically. To get flowers quickly, you can either grow them by buying them in your shop, or you can get pre-grown ones that are on distant islands using a Nook Miles ticket. Once you have all the flowers you want and they're all grown, you'll notice that bugs will start to spawn on them. At this point, you're just going to want to start catching as many as possible and filling your inventory, but before you do that, you're probably going to want to prepare a few extra nets first and drop them off to the side. The reason you want to drop them off to the side is so that way you have a lot more room in your inventory for catching bugs. After you've caught all the bugs that have spawned, go in a circle or a little distance away from your flower bed and you'll find that more bugs will spawn. Uh, I don't know why this happens, it just does, and this is why this method is easier than catching fish and going to the fish guy. See? Look at that. Wow. Oh my gosh. Holy shit. Do you see that? Do you see that man face stink bug? I've caught so fucking many of those before I like got rich and stuff. Look at that. Look at how bugs that you bring. The more bugs that you bring back in your inventory will determine how much you actually make when you go sell. Also keep in mind that some bugs are worth more than others, so sometimes trading them for other bugs when you see them is actually worth it. Also, you'll notice that Flick wanders around quite a bit. If you want to prevent this, just dig a bunch of holes around them. It can be a little tricky, but once you get it, they'll stay in that spot. Feel free to do the same thing with other NPCs if they start bothering you. And that about wraps up Strat 1 for you people who don't want to time skip. Now moving on to Strat 2 for those that do. Basically what you're going to do first is repeat everything that you do for Strat 1. But, since you guys are okay with time skipping, what you can do is time skip until you have Flick on your island, and then do your farming then. Now your goal is going to be to make a million bells and put them all in your bank account. This could be a little time consuming, so make sure you take a couple breaks in between, but after enough effort, you'll be making millions in no time. Once you finally have a million bells in your bank account, congrats by the way, you're going to go out of the game. Make sure you save before you go out. But fully close the game, and then go into settings, move forward a year, and re-enter the game. The reason you fully close is so that way the game registers that uh, time can actually change, because it won't change if the game's still open. Uh, so it's very crucial that you save. And after time traveling a year and logging back on, you'll see that you've made essentially 100k bells in your account. This is because of the interest that uh, your 1 million accumulates over that year. Just make sure you're keeping at least 1 million in your bank account at all times so that way you can continue using the strat and getting that 100k every time you log back on. And with that, I told you guys everything you need to know about strat 2. If you know a better strategy, please let me know in the comments. If you need help, also let me know in the comments. I'd be happy to help you out with any questions that you have. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. You know what? I think this game gets me sometimes, because I love destroying shit. <laughs> oh my god, yes! Jeez, I really need to build a bridge there. It's so annoying. I hate switching my stuff all the time. Oh my god.
do you know how many times I restarted my game for this? Do you actually understand? Can you comprehend how many times I restarted my game? Why is it that I beat the game and <laughs> no matter what I try to do, my villagers' houses still look better than mine? Not just on the inside, the outside too. You know, some people ask me why I don't like to play at 10 p.m. This is why. This is why right here. Oh! Huh? Quite honestly, I don't know why I ate that cheesecake. Why the fuck am I, am I not moving? What? What? My like, house right my now. First game. In my you house. can't be serious. I'm seeing like, my stuff. Hey guys, just quick spider update. Uh, I'm immune to spiders now. Literally, they just don't kill me anymore. I don't know what happened, but they just don't kill me. It's probably the best thing that's ever happened. For those of you in the comments who thought that I didn't actually demolish the Zen bridges, uh, I actually did. Uh, in, in fact, I demolitioned two of them, and I'll show the proof right now. Uh, basically, you are a fuckboy, and, after and a fuckgirl, and, and a shit, fucking, fucking piece fucking of shit, I hell. actually did that shit. That. Are you watching? You'll get money right now? Like, I actually, money. like, destroyed and you'll get more like, money. Really expensive. And once you get money, and I get money, two shits and you just keep getting, because I had so much money, keep buying stuff. I can buy in my house, I can buy If you think that I wouldn't sacrifice a couple of stupid things in the game, it'll take a little while because of the announcements and stuff. I would. I would do that. That's why I did it. That's why I'm probably doing this a lot. So you know how annoying. many like, people I already kind of love talking it. about it. I don't I care. Seen, like, that's flashbacks. I actually killed two of them. I am still doing it because you're looking at I, the feed right I need now. this stuff. I need I all this stuff. I killed both in my house right and now. And they're gone. Looking in my house. All I have is I'm seeing my stuff. You are fucking.